Okay, so today we're going to look at the non-burning paper. Um, in this demonstration, I've taken a piece of paper and I have doused it in a solution containing some alcohol that will make it burn. Um, and we're going to see if this piece of paper will really burn or not. Um, I've not only, I mean, we all know a piece of paper burns, and I've taken that and I've added some alcohol to it to make it burn even more. So, of course, we would expect it to burn really brightly, right? But indeed, once we light it on fire, we find that the piece of paper hasn't burned at all. And that has everything to do with something that we're going to call the specific heat capacity of water. Where the specific heat capacity is the ability of water to absorb lots of heat. So the heat from the burning alcohol is absorbed by the water that I have also added to that beaker. Now just to prove this to you, I am going to show you what happens whenever you take a piece of paper and you put it in only alcohol, not an alcohol water mix. This one has only been in alcohol. Now we'll watch it burn. And indeed the paper, which has not been wetted by water, burns to an ash very, very quickly. Of course we know what happens whenever we have something that's wet with just water and we try to burn it, right? We know that water absorbs a lot of heat, so whenever we try to burn it, it doesn't burn at all. The water just absorbs all of the heat from the flame. Now, yeah, it's great to do that with a piece of paper, but, you know, really, we, I have to put my money where my mouth is, and I've got a dollar bill here. And not just a dollar bill, I've got a hundred dollar bill here. So we're going to try to see and make sure that we are not, we can, we can burn this dollar without actually burning it to ashes. So I'm going to make sure that I put it in my solution. I want to get it nice and soaked. There's alcohol and water. Let me just unfold it. Now we're ready to try to burn our hundred dollar bill. That money is literally burning a hole in my pocket. But because there was water present in that solution that soaked up into the dollar bill, the dollar bill is still just fine. In fact, it feels a little cool. Now if you don't do this right and you don't add a little water to the alcohol, in fact your dollar bill will burn. So if, you know, you really probably shouldn't be trying this, but if you're, if you're like, you know what, I need some other way to burn through some money, um, make sure that you use an alcohol solution that is at least 50% water, okay? Otherwise, the, the dollar bill will burn just like my $1 bill here did. So thanks for watching, and uh, have a great day.